Well, next, activate. Well, activate is a concept that's designed to drive change, to do something about, for instance, the fact, as I mentioned earlier, 70% of the unemployed in South Africa are under the age of 34. Well, young people and stakeholders from public and private sector are going to be gathering at Constitution Hill in Johannesburg on June 11th as a start. And we've got two of the activators, I think, on the line to tell us what their role is. We have Koketsa Moeti. She is a lobbyist and digital manager, uh, digital content manager for local government action. Are you with us, Koketsa? Hi, yes, I am. Nice to have you with us. Good. We're also going to be chatting to Pearl Pillay. She's the International Affairs Officer on the SRC at VIT. We're going to be chatting to her just now. Okay, so let's start with you. Um, you are, well, how do you describe yourself in activate, change, activate change, uh, terms? Are you, are you an activator? What are you? Yes, essentially we're all activators, which is a network of young people to equip the drive change for the public good. Okay. And did you get chosen? Have you put yourself forward? Um, essentially, the program is open to anyone in South Africa. All you need to do is apply. Okay. So that's what makes it so diverse, because it's not limited to a certain six of the population. And what, have you, what are you required to do? What is your action? Okay. Essentially, there is no required action. What you do is you go through a program which equips you with certain skills. Because everybody who comes to the Activate program is essentially doing something by themselves. So here you're provided with a platform on which you can connect with others, you know, and gain skills which can drive your vision even further. And that's essentially what we do. It takes the potential that we exist and we try to do something more. Okay, so I'm sorry, your line is not terrific, Coquette, so I hope you could all right. So the program that you've undergone, what skills were you given? Um, the first, it's a three-year program. So the first show, which took place last year, was the living, was the living part of it. We had different modules. So the first one focusing on yourself, on yourself. You know, we often speak about the change, but we ignore the fact that as individuals, we also need to survive and all these other conflicting factors which exist. So essentially you go through the you know, motions you get different you equip with um, different means of exploration, you know? And then the second module which we focus on engagement. We do we had different um that we did which were focused on these dialogues, debating skills and yeah, just how you mm -hmm. should engage. We also start, like to find out about the IPC, your municipalities, and things that some young South Africans don't know that we should. Yeah. You know, Kuket, so sadly, I'm really struggling to hear you. I'm sorry, I'm gonna, going to leave it at that. I can hear that you're doing all sorts of good things, but I'm afraid it's a bit of a battle to hear you. But very best of luck uh, at the Activate uh, Forum. So let's uh, try Pearl Pillay, who's another one of the activators. Uh, hi, Pearl, are you with us? I, oh, I'm oh, with you. Yes. Can you hear me? I can. You're very echoey. You're not on a speakerphone, are you? I am no longer on a speakerphone. It's good. Just better. Okay, yes, it's a lot better. Okay. So I could, from what I could hear of what Koketsa was saying, you've all undergone this program. But what is, what's the purpose? You're all going to be meeting at the, um, at the exchange forum on June the 11th. With what in mind? Okay, so basically what Activate seeks to do is connect young people from around the country that are driven by the need for um, change and social justice in our country. Mm. And the program itself, I mean, if you're not part of the program, then obviously you're not privy to the skills that, that, that um, it equips you with and you're not privy to this network. And what the exchange does is it then connects people that are in the program with people that are not. Um, so members of the community, other people that are interested in what we're doing, as well as relevant stakeholders. So we've got people coming in from Love Life and from government, and there's someone from Standard as well that's going to be on the panel um, this week. And it basically links you up with people that you would not otherwise 
be in contact with. Um, and the aim of it is to f- facilitate a discussion around social change and how whatever we're doing in our communities and our local capacities, how we can then make it better and how we can work with each other um, in this great network that we formed um, to achieve, you know, our common goal. So that's basically the aim of what the Activated is. Um, it's just for us to meet and facilitate a dialogue that we wouldn't usually be able to do. A dialogue, hopefully, with some sort of action plan at the end of it. Well, yes. Um, one of the great things about Activate is that it, it brings together people that are already doing something. Um, and so what happens is you then get equipped on how you can make your campaign or your project better and how you can improve the way you approach things. So you automatically go in there with an end goal in mind. Um, and the aim, one of the biggest things that Activate focuses on is networking. So the aim of the exchange, obviously, is to create a new network um, and to obviously, you know, see how you can move your projects forward. So as much as it, yes, it's a dialogue on the one hand, but whatever comes out of that dialogue um, needs to be something that's going to push you forward. So all the activators already need to be doing something over and above whatever it is that they're doing career-wise or with their life. They need to have some sort of vision for change action. Yes, um, it is just what's needed, um, and it's not it's not just in the realms of activism because a lot of people are under the assumption that unless you're an activist or someone that's pushing for some kind of socioeconomic justice, um, you can't be part of the program. But you find at Activate we have people from the business sector, so people that are interested in opening up a business um, or people that are interested in agriculture. So whatever it is that you're doing. Um, and if you have some kind of vision for better South Africa, you're an activator or you qualify to be an activator. So it brings everyone together and you exchange ideas with people that are, you know, across the spectrum, different sectors, and it links everyone um, so that you can somehow find a way of working together. So as an example, what is your vision? My vision is a South Africa that is committed to social justice. Um, it's an equal society, and it's one that recognizes that it is, it is our, it our duty to help those that are less fortunate than us. South Africa is a society in which we're all equal, um, politically, economically, and socially. And that obviously means that we then need to have buy-in from all aspects of our society, because it's not something that one sector can do alone. Yeah, I'm, I'm absolutely, absolutely right. I couldn't fault that at all. But I suppose the question is, how do you do it? How personally do you plan to do it? Well, in my view, um, I used to be of the view of, well, we're all going to change the world. And as you grow up, you kind of realize that you're not really going to change the world. But if you work on changing someone's world, then you've made a difference. Mm. And I think for me, um, and and something that I push is even if you change one person's world, if everyone changes someone's world, you make quite a big difference at the end of the day. And it's kind of that pay it forward um, philosophy. So it's in your little capacity, whatever you can do, you must do. Um, you know, even if it means compared to the guy who lives on the street, you know, you're doing something um, rather than just, you know, sitting back and criticizing and being cynical about everything, just do something. Um, and that, you know, creates some kind of ripple effect. And, and do something on an ongoing basis. It's not just about uh, just a, sort of a one-off action. Yes, I mean, change is a process, you know, and yeah. it's something that happens because it was a continuous effort. So, you know, it's not something that you can decide, okay, on one day we're all going to do this and then, you know, we're sorted for the rest of the year. It's something you have to commit to um, and something you have to make a lot of sacrifices for. But with an end goal in mind, you know, the end does justify the means. Well, just lastly, the, uh, it's the, the forum, it's the exchange forum is coming up on June the 11th at uh, Constitution Hill. Can anybody mm-hmm. arrive or do you have to be invited? How can it work? You have to RSVP. Um, I believe that there are very few spots left. Um, because people have been RSVPing mm. quite rapidly. But if interested in attending, then they just need to send an email to communications at activateleadership.co.za. Okay, communications at activateleadership.co.za. Yeah, and, it's um, and then I think if people are still confused, then they can just tweet to activate. Um, the handle is at activateza, and then they can just get more information that way if it's easier. At activateza. Yeah. Okay, at activate ZA. That's the Twitter handle. 
communications at activateleadership.co.za. And mm-hmm. I think if you want to check the website and find out a little bit more, it's www.activateleadership.co.za. It's yeah. happening at Constitutional Hill. It feels like it should be happening all over the country. Will there be other Activate forums? There have been. Um, what, so what's ongoing. happening currently is in major cities so far, um, so there was one in Durban a few months ago, and then there's now one in, in Johannesburg, and there should be one in Cape Town very soon. Um, because it's a literally small network at this point, it's just major cities, um, but I believe that it is one of the goals of Activate for this year to take it into um, so-called smaller cities um, so that you know people have easier access to it. We'll give out the details once again. Pearl, thank you very much and very best of luck with all your actions. Thank you very much.